Hello, this is me, Holly, from Holly's Hot Spurs, here to give my match reaction. Sorry, it wasn't instant. Um, I was too busy celebrating having beers yesterday to be able to articulate uh, a match reaction. But Tottenham did beat Everton 4-0 in our first home game of the season. If you're new to the channel, please give us a like, share, comment and subscribe so you never miss a video. Yes, people, I kind of all said that we, we wanted a bounce back, obviously, from that Leicester draw 1-1 uh, on Monday night. Um, and a bounce back we had. Uh, Everton, my word, are in some serious trouble this season, I think. Obviously, after losing 3-0 to uh, Brighton, to then come to uh, the Tottenham Hotspur Stadium to then lose 4-0 to us... Is a bit awkward for Sam Dyche, I'm not going to lie to you. Um, but anyway, uh, the lineup came out. Uh, I was very taken aback that he uh, Anish decided to chuck um, Odebert straight in. But my word, what a player. Uh, he's definitely got a lot of potential uh, at Tottenham, I think. And it was great to see him obviously play so well in his debut. I think the one big thing for me is the fact that he was just wanting to take on a man. And OK, sometimes it didn't quite work out for him. But I liked the fact that his first instinct was to go forward and drive with the ball rather than turn back and, and pass it backwards. Um, so he had a brilliant game, I thought. So I can't wait to see more of him. Uh, obviously, uh, we saw Basuma as well start in midfield. Uh, the funny thing, after, obviously, the uh, kind of match... Uh, interview with Ad Foster Cockley. Obviously, Basuma scored an absolute whiz bomber that smacked the top of the crossbar and went in, obviously making us go 1 0 up. And afterwards, And was kind of asked, obviously, putting Basuma in the team. And he was like, yeah, I might just suspend him more often uh, if he's going to come back and do stuff like that. So brilliant for Basuma. Great goal. Obviously, I think it was his first as well for Tottenham. So great for him to obviously having that bit of a Awkward start to the season, being a bit of a naughty boy. He's definitely redeemed himself uh, on the football pitch. Uh, and then obviously we saw a lot of high pressing from Sonny, which managed to get his uh, reward with the second goal, obviously taking the ball uh, off of Pickford, England's number one, may I add, uh, to slot it into the back of the net. But it was just a, a great overall game. We were c kind of had the full game to ourselves pretty much. There's probably a dull moment, maybe 10 minutes, I think, uh, towards the end of the first half. But apart from that, I, I don't think Everton really had a look in, to be honest with you. Uh, obviously, then we saw a great uh, goal from Romero. Uh, again, uh, headering the ball into uh, the back of the net. Obviously, he had to rise over Tarkovsky and there was another defender behind him that he managed to get in between two of them to put it into the back of the net. And then a brilliant solo run from Nicky van der Ven. As soon as he got the ball, and I was sat in the south down, as soon as he got the ball and he was running with it, I was like... That's it, we're scoring here. Uh, so he managed to carry on running and he slipped it through to Sonny and Sonny smacked it into the back of the net and then we walked away with the 4-0 victory. There's a lot of positives from that game. I'm just glad that we kind of took the game. We had a lot of possession. We had a lot of chances and we took our chances, which I was very pleased about, obviously, after that game against Leicester. Uh, let me know your thoughts in the comment sections below. Uh, for me, I think Mickey van der Ven was my match. I'm not being biased, but that solo run for him then to pass to Sonny did the day for me um yeah let me know your thoughts in the comment section on your man the match um also what else you think uh from the game obviously i will be dissecting this in more tomorrow in holly Hotspurs live so make sure you tune in for that one and we will be having a little giveaway uh so make sure you tune in as well towards the end of the show when we chat about that but yeah great result and come on you spurs